Welcome back to Osiris Wrath. I hate sorry, cliffhangers. Let's cliffhanger. go. Yeah, yeah. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. All right. So last time we died. Imagine that. Oh wait, no, we're, we didn't die. Not quite. Not n not quite. I mean, it's a cliffhanger. Like, come on. L like an actual cliffhanger. And smashed by the giant hands. Get some control on that thing, Yasha. Come on. There we go. Did we make it? Nope, <laughs> we were uh, ten feet under feet of clay. Feet of clay, that's all that's left. Osara has to fight with only his feet. Gosh, <laughs> he'll find a way. <laughs> Even the feet have grunts. Disappointed. What happened? <laughs> he just made a face like, yeah, kind of. <laughs> <laughs> oh, they got smashed so hard that they went into the Brahmastra? Pretty much. Dude. We are we are inside the Brahmastra, or the Mantra Fortress, or whatever. Deus is here, Mithra's here, they're at the top, so let's head towards the center. Oh, damn. I was just like, yeah, let's go, 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 go! No, 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 come on, come on, come on, come on! Should've done this yesterday, come on! Oh, shit. Should've done this 12,000 years ago. <laughs> oh, that's what I meant by yesterday. I mean, yesterday can be an extended period of time in this day and age. A cosmic hour, you see. Yeah. Oh, there's so much lag in this level. There's a lot of stuff oh, going on. Oh my god. Come on, PS3, come on. You can do it. That's why I really want this game to be on, like, PS4 and Xbox One, new PC consoles. See, that's what I'm wondering. Since uh, all the newer-gen consoles are doing backwards compatibility now, I wonder if this is one of the games and it would run smoother on the X-Bone or PS4. I don't, I don't know. I mean, as far as I can tell, I can't see any big difference between the PS3 and 360 versions, so... But just bring it to PC. I'm sure a lot of people will stop complaining after that. Mm -hmm. Yeah, bring it to Steam. $20 price tag, there you go. Yes, I'm in control. Just move everywhere. I really wish you could spin in circles during that. All right, so destroy the destroy the core of the uh, the Brahmastra and Deus goes down, right? Did I hear that correctly? Pretty much. It's the source of his power. We're pretty much releasing all the souls that we've gotten for 10,000 years. And how many humans did we kill? Seven trillion. Holy shit! Seven trillion people dead over 12,500 years. We have killed the oh. Earth like one and a half times over. No kidding. Modern Earth, mind you. Oh, okay, yeah, yeah, modern Earth. Because this being, you know, uh, the the, uh, the ancient world, the world's population was not as big. That is insanity. They, they've been busy. Shit. Uh, oh. I don't think I've I don't think I've even seen the number seven trillion. My God, that's a big number. Look at all them zeros. It's too many zeros. Um, I mean, if we throw in a quintillion there. I mean, I don't think I'd be able to fathom that many zeros. I feel like that. I feel like that the uh, death toll should have been a lot higher. It's like, how many did you bastards kill? A Google. What? Yeah. <laughs> Holy shit. Uh, how, how many more in another uh, ten thousand years? Oh, a Googleplex. Oh god. <laughs> Actually, it's funny so, you mentioned Google and death. <laughs> uh, Google's not going anywhere. Can't kill Google. Getting big Star Fox flashbacks right now. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking. Like, I feel like this is uh, straight from a part from Star Fox Armada. Or Assault. I keep wanting to call it Armada. It would be a better title than Assault. That's what it was called. And they changed the name. Alright, so that was the Brahmastra's internal defense system, correct? Not a very good one. I don't know why they put holes in there. I'm, I'm just thinking, why don't they do the Resident Evil thing and make a net? Yeah. Yeah, he'd just punch it out. <laughs> punch the death laser. Are these three ships overturn and they're gonna be throwing some missiles at us, I guess. Or some lasers. Ooh. They they do they do hurt. Quite considerably they do hurt. We'll go ahead and burst a little bit after getting some more points. And here we go. Rev it. Alright guys, knock him down. Ah! Oh, oh my, my god. Ooh, Yasha. Where did that come from? 
What did that do? That didn't do anything. I mean, come it on. Didn't feel ah! 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 Oh, sticks the landing. Ten out of ten. He's had practice. Yeah, 12,000 years worth of practice. There's a seven for the Russian judge. <laughs> it's always the Russian judge. Goddamn stickler. It's very, very hard to please. Doesn't even like sports. <laughs> He's there on commission. They said they pay him well. <laughs> pay him well in a communist nation. <laughs> I don't you know. get to move to the front of the bread line. <laughs> Anything goes. Oh, no. Oh, well, that's, uh, lovely. Oh, this is gonna set him off. No, it already did! <laughs> but then, well, oh. Oh, no. You you gone, done, and did it. Not that easy yet. Oh, Deus, don't piss him off more. Didn't you see what happened? We gotta beat Bowser before we can save the princess. Damn it! Well, sorry, we gotta defeat Ganondorf before we can save, save the, the princess. princess. Hmm. Nintendo has a very uh, uh, one plus one type of type of material here. One plus one equals. I must know what I think is right. And every time Bowser gets more fierce, Ganon gets more fierce. The fate of on his and to be honest, the princess gets more fierce. Oh so no! <laughs> Mask Deus! Yeah, Mask Deus here is like all. Yeah, he's super, super charged himself now. Calamity Deus! Calamity. <laughs> yeah, Calamity Deus. I mean, sure, whatever. <laughs> I mean, at first we were fighting Xant, and now we're fighting Ganondorf, if you understand me. So he's got like super powerful fucking electricity. And Yasha just does Yasha things. Come on, come on, Asura breakthrough, there we go, kick his ass! So here goes, final battle between Asura, Yasha, and Deus. Seriously? To determine the fate of the world. Oh god, this seems a bit too, like, short. A bit too short? What do you mean? No, I mean, this... I thought this game would at least reach the... the you know, without the bonus episode, it would reach about the 20 episode mark. I want to think that this goes above and beyond just taking down the Brahmastra and Deus. I want there to be like some super mega ultra boss to fight, and it turns out it's Mithra in disguise. Oh god, that hurt. You don't even know how funny that is yet. What? No! Anyway, so uh, no! we're gonna. So we'll just focus on right now. Uh, right now, is what we're focusing on. Uh, Deus hits pretty hard. He's got really powerful electricity, but that uh, Asura can take most of these hits. So we'll go ahead and go with the first mode, and... Boom! Oh, yes, right in the face! But his nose, man, don't punch him in the nose! Oh, God. That's like his str that's like his strongest area, his most well-armored... <laughs> so now, next phase, <laughs> we're doing Yasha. Oh, that was ya great! Now, Yasha, unfortunately, as we've established, can't take a hit worth shit. Oh, no, is he brittle? Well, I... Yeah, he's very brittle, so whenever he gets hit by Deus, it hurts! There's even one quick time event that uh, I messed up several times and I've died like twice. It's that one right there! Oh, oh god! My health a... is gone! Oh, that's a half health! <laughs> Demon damage. God, that sucks! And it comes out of nowhere. It's almost like, oh, by the way, quick time event. Oh, god! Oh, that's mean. Oh. So, so I, get, I can't just be mashing buttons relentlessly. I gotta, like, really. Focus on it. Make sure he's not going to do that one move. Mm -hmm. So I'm going to throw in a bunch. Oh, there, he, there it is. Oh, nice. Huh. That would have ended me. Pretty sure. He's so powerful. And I actually do like this from just a you know cinematic perspective. That also gets knocked out of the fight. So Yasha's still here, and he continues the fight. It flows well. Yasha wasn't like Asura, no. Yeah, it works from a gameplay per perspective, too, because you have Asura doing it, now we got Yasha having a turn, because we played Yasha for a good chunk of the third season. And now both of them. And... Uh, oh, well. I mean, that's what you get for getting a grade. I mean, you would have hit him in the face had you gotten an excellent. Yes! Yeah, that's what have worked. Yes! Do I have to separate you two? Don't make me turn this Bramaster around. Yeah, actually, we do want that to happen. I mean, yeah, yeah. Are we there yet? Are we there yet? Yes! And 
Yeah. Destroy the pointy nose man. Destroy him. Here's what I think of your pointy nose. Ooh, yes! Oh. Oh, he, he's not done yet, no. Damn it! I just made him matter. Well, you think the most powerful being in the universe is just gonna step down like that? No, oh, man. No, of course not. We need something catastrophic. We need something bigger. And so Yasha was crucified. Oh, well. I mean, fate befitting a hero, I guess. Yeah. Come on, Austin. Come on! No, yeah, this is it. Destroy him. So now he's going to look up to Mithra, who is, you know, that's just wrong. Oh, don't zap more of her power. That's not fair. Wasn't she in like a, some sort of case or display case when we first saw her? Why is she all wrapped up like a BDSM story right now? Oh, I was thinking that it was like she got tangled up in the power lines. She just ended up there. <laughs> It's like she oh, oh, geez, oh, geez. Someone called an electrician. Uh, broke out of the... Oh, oh, no, 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 come <laughs> on! It's a head stop in good time. Oh. <laughs> oh, insult to injury. Just curb stomp you right in front of your daughter. Not only that, but he's getting all this power from the, from the humans, like the ones that we haven't destroyed, and Mithra's power, so he's just getting even more powerful. But you think that's going to stop the most powerful, angriest dad in the world? <laughs> I mean, he's not polishing shotguns. He's destroying planets if you mess with his daughter. Yes. Damn it! What happened, Luke? Oh, you are satisfied. As many as it takes to save the world. Enough. I'm gonna destroy the world to save the world. Because the world can be saved if we kill everyone in it. God, that's a line right out of a serial killer. Either that or, uh, Cold Tycoon's, uh, manifesto. Yes, yes, destroy him. Maim him. And... Oh, what? I like how everyone just steals my daughter and thinks that they know what's best for her. <laughs> what a caring dad Osara is. And boom. There yes! Go. Finally! And boom. That was a three-armed punch. Oh, looks like it hurt like hell. Good. Okay. All right. Let me try uh, something else. Uh-huh. Crick in the neck. All right. Oh. Let me just let me just go fucking Super Saiyan here. He's now a mini Brahmastra. Mantra Deus, I guess. He has become Amadeus. Hmm. Hmm. Okay. Oh, okay. Uh, part three. So, part three, this is the big fight. The big final fight between us and Deus. This will determine the fate of the world for, for really reals, guys. Okay. So, just uh, do what you've always been doing, I suppose. A limited power, and then heavy attacks, and then lock on with the jump and the light attacks. And then Check it. in the uh, oh, uh, uh, uh. Ooh. Nope. <laughs> nope, I win. Oh. So here we go. Oh. <laughs> oh, this is great. Oh, that's that's fantastic. Don't you mess with me. And <laughs> boom. Oh my god, I love this game so much. <laughs> that's that, I tell you, after all the shit he's put us through for 17 <laughs> episodes, so that is. Good. Super satisfying, man. Oh, that is so good. Let's do it again. Please, oh. can we get more final bosses that are so obnoxious that you actually get to pin them down and punch their face off? You ever played God of War 3? No. You get to punch Hercules' face off. Oh, my God. I need to play that now. One Speaking more to punch time. The face off, let's go again. Boom, boom, boom. Everybody dies! Can you imagine just getting hit like that over and over again by a fucking steel bar? Oh god. I mean, even a god is going. Oh my god. 
I mean, tone it down a bit, man. All right, uh, my uh, nose has now caved into my brain. Mm -hmm. Yes, yes, yes. And angry Ooh. dad. Ooh. <laughs> oh, he just, he just burned up God power with a punch. Man, he just got killed the way Cell did. In one punch. Oh. He's, he's got really nice pants. Never mentioned that. He's got really nice pants. Felt that one, didn't ya? So all the mantra and all the power is released. All his power is drained. Oh, uh, that was it? That was it. Deus is defeated. Oh, he's got a pointy chin, too. And now Mithra is released, her bonds are free. Because the link between the Mantra Fortress and her has been severed. <laughs> Last quick time event, catch your daughter. Oh, shit, failed. <laughs> She just falls faster if you mi miss the button prompt. <laughs> Yay, we win! Now let's take let's take let's take a moment, just relax. We finally did it <sighs> after all this time. And then, Asura died. It's not over yet, though. Oh no! So now all, all that mantra that Deus uh, gave to the Brahmastra is now being sent. To the Goma. Oh, mm -hmm. oh my God! So you, so you know what's gonna happen now? Big boss time! Big boss time! Yes! I'll defeat Final Chaos. Charging at whatever is in front of you can save the world. I don't know. It seemed to work for a lot of games. Yep. Vlitra's awake, and he's had his coffee with a shot of espresso on the side. Oh dear. Oh, and he's also on like cocaine, so he's uber mad, Whoa. uber powerful. We have two guardian generals, one priestess, no mantra fortress, no armada to back us up. We are just two dudes right now. Oh my god. And he is more powerful than he was at the beginning of the game. Just a big old fucking Orochi mess coming out of the planet. Time to fuck it up! Time to fuck up. Oh, ooh, oh no! Something's getting fucked up. I mean, that just took out like 20 stars right there. <laughs> stars, planets with giant holes in them. Three of them will be, will be destroyed in about uh, 20 years. So, Vlitra's awakened, and we're, we're, oh man, we are so fucked. <laughs> but we did it out of love. We destroyed the entire universe for love. So it's like, oh, Vlitra's back? All right, I'll take care of him, no problem, let's go. Cracks all six knuckles. <laughs> oh, bring it on! Actually, wait, four, eight, twelve, sixteen, twenty-four knuckles, really. All right. Oops. Not counting the thumbs. So, all right, Vlitra's back, and... Boy, they love grabbing the shoulders, don't they? Well, I mean, look how chiseled they are. No. Actually, I will be honest, the entire time I forgot that Vlitra existed. <laughs> like, I thought we beat Deus and the game's over. I completely forgot that the Gomo nope. were a thing. Oh, oh, yeah! I mean, you wouldn't know, because it's been a long time since we fought some. Right, right. Seems like the, the gods are the true villains here, and the Goma is just the will of the planet. So when do we go up into heaven and beat the pillar known as God? No, oh, wait, wrong series. Anyway, um... <laughs> so Deus is uh, on his last legs. Like, he's probably going to die in the next couple minutes. Mithra's awake and uh, sees the family member that betrayed her. That's lovely. 
So, uh, how was that 12,000 year nap? Hey! So, uh, about your it's mom. T- it's time for your union break! Actually, what if she did ask, where's my mother? <laughs> she asked, I think she knows. He fought to save you. <laughs> your dad has literally gone through hell and back multiple times to get to this point. We must do. Almost as much as Kratos. <laughs> well, Kratos, Kratos dies every Wednesday. Do I swear, every every game he's in, he dies once. Is he going to die in the new one? <laughs> uh, probably. The, da- the dad of war will die, and then he'll be back. <laughs> Yeah, Dad of War dies, and then his stupid son's gonna be the next protagonist. Actually, why don't they both die, but he can't save his son, so then he goes back and he he loses all of his counseling, and then just nothing works anymore. How about I just not buy it, because I don't give a shit about it anymore. There we go. So, goodbye, Deus! Goodbye! No! He used to be a machine, but he's not anymore, so I guess he's a Deus Ex Machina. I knew this game would pull a bullshit ending. Poof. So, alright. That's what we gotta deal with. That's, uh, gonna be a fun one. Next time, of course. Mm Mm-hmm. Yep. I didn't think we'd have a gigantic boss battle. I mean, that was an awesome boss fight. But now we've got a bigger threat to deal with. Ah, not enough battle points. Hey, but you got some sass. You got an S. I got some sass, though. I do got some sass. I think the lock-on shots are what give you most, and the special attacks, too. I'm pretty sure if I would have done those quick-time events, it would have been a little bit better. Maybe mm-hmm. if I would have not gotten hit so much, that would have worked, too, but whatever. An S-rank is an S-rank is an S-rank is an S-rank. And who's our, uh, illustrator this time? Fuck me. Not this guy again. Oh, this looks awesome. It's like I, I can't find any more about Satoshi Sakai. He's the dot hack guy. That's all I got. Well, time to go to another studio. Uh, maybe I'll, uh... Hmm. Try PA Works. They worked on some of the animated cutscenes. How about you, Photobull? No, that's Bizaria. That's I don't know, I'll find something. S- somebody besides Satoshi Sakai. He's done more illustrations than anybody else here. And for good reason. This looks great. Oh my god, look how cool that looks. So it's about Deus and his, uh, like, it was how the plot to overthrow the Emperor began. But he doesn't want to become Emperor, because if, you, if he's an Emperor, then he's just gonna rot at a throne forever. But he's gonna dedicate himself to the cause, probably even looking to, uh, kill himself in order to, uh, destroy Vlitra. Hmm. But the thing is, he's, you know... Killed one too many people and pissed off one too many workers. So uh, really, this is this is just a really elaborate workers' strike, I suppose. Casting a large shadow. Except it's only one guy picketing the line. But whatever. Next time on Asura's Wrath, the final the episode. Asura must overcome Holy the shit! Of two of his employees went goddamn postal and killed him. <laughs>